Hello, and welcome to Let's Play Sonic 3 and Knuckles. I am Piddlesticks, and I will be playing Sonic 3 and Knuckles. I hope you enjoy it. Of course, I have to click on the proper game first. But I think we can sort that out. Okay. Start a new game. Yeah, Sonic 3 and Knuckles, the expansion, is probably my favourite Sonic game and one of my most favourite games of all time. So, I've played this game a lot and I've beaten it a lot. I wonder why that green emerald was left to last. Like, I honestly don't know why. Yeah. Anyway, this I'm playing Sonic and Tails. You can choose to play as just Tails or just Sonic, but I want them both because I like them both. Now, break that rock, get those rings, spring pad, spring pad, floating island thing, and run. And, oh, and spin dash. Kill the rhino, jump, jump. Now, in this hidden cave is the first giant ring uh, to enter the warp zone, special zone thing. It's the Get Blue Spheres mini game kind of thing, I guess you could call it. That's, uh, I'm not going to bother about collecting all the coins because it just saves time, so just not. But if you do uh, uh, coins, rings, if you collect all the rings, you just pretty much get an extra life at the end, which. Uh, is probably beneficial if you're shit at Sonic. So obviously the object here is to just get the blue spheres. Like, that's what it's called, so it's obviously what you gotta do. And it really isn't that hard. It um, is tricky at first, but like I said before, I've played this a lot. And it's uh fairly simple to me now and that is the first one done so that's the first emerald ready it's uh, really not overly hard to get emeralds in this game uh, but if you can't do these mini games and you're really not gonna have much fun because the whole object for most Sonic games is to get Super Sonic that's just makes the gameplay more fun Loop-de-loop, -loop, jump the water, and spring pad. Oh, it's coconuts. I shall kill you now. Yeah, there we go. Whoop. Spin dash, and break. And rings, and invincibility. And trap behind spikes. Whoa, no, I don't want to go there. I want to go up here to collect something special. Yeah. Jump. Ten additional rings and a life. Because don't just love getting a life. It's, it's pretty swell. Oh, can I make it? Yes, I can. Now, this technically is the midway boss, but you can't fight him now. You can jump on him, but he won't die. Uh, he can kill you, though, if you are careless and get hurt easily by standing underneath him. Uh, but he only shows up to pretty much destroy everything, and everything's on fire now. If you jump into them, you'll go to a, a little bonus stage. Ooh, I like this one coming up. You're pretty, if you get touched by the evil ray of death, that's what we're going to call it, um, that's not good. You'll be exited from, whoa, the little mini zone. Yeah, you're supposed to make it to the very, very top, collecting these little colorful orbs to unlock items, like shields. Run, 
Sonic. No. It's okay. Nah. Oh, it's so fun. It reminds me of Carnival Night Zone, which is a level that we will get up to in a future Let's Play, and that's the end of it. Wait, no? Whoa! But I don't know what's happening. There we go. I don't know what happened there. It was kind of crazy. Okay. Break, break. This is where the... S if you can break the wall, you can find the second Get Blue Spheres ring. That's what we'll call them. Now, I absolutely hate this one. It, it's not that it's hard, it's just big, and I get lost quite easily because I am retarded. And as many times as I've done it, I still just never seem to work out a little plan for myself uh, of where I should go to get all of them. Because I am that silly. Okay. Um, maybe this way? Yay! Oh, I think I've actually got it the right way this time. Yeah, I have. This last one, um, I've done it many times before. If you actually get it before you've gotten the all the rest of them, you can't run a full square because it will just kill you. It will turn into a square of red spheres and you'll die. Because it needs to be a certain amount of length of a square to fill all the ones you've missed in the middle. I'm not sure if what I'm saying is even making sense, but hopefully you understand my silly gibberish. But yeah, uh, you will die if you don't quickly move out of the way. Kill the caterpillar. Flying fox. Leave tails behind. And rings. Spring pad. Okay, and here. Ah, oh, he got it, you bastard. Well, I'm gonna kill you with fire. Yeah. Fire shield, which obviously makes you immune to fire. Which will be great here. Because this is the mid boss. Bam. 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 Let's kill him before he goes over there. Uh, wait. Yeah, we go. That's how we roll. Into Mobius. Now, if you want to be silly and waste all your time, like me, you can continually jump here. And if you've got tails, it just gets small points. A hundred each time. You can do this for hours because there's no time limit. It's just your skill and how bored you are as a person with your sad life. It's entirely up to you. Now, I think I am going to call it an episode. Uh, on the next one, we will get two more emeralds and or hopefully get two more emeralds and we'll take on Robotnik for the first time. So, yeah. Uh, tune in next time. Thanks for watching.